Hi, this is Rakesh, structural engineer. Today I am going to show you G plus one house plan for the site area of 40 by 60 feet. Now I am going to show you this site plan. This is the site. This site has the north facing road, existing road with 25 feet wide. In this north direction, we have 40 feet wide, and this is the west direction. In this west direction, we have 60 feet length. For this site area, I am going to show you ground plus first floor plan. First, we will go to the first floor plan. Sorry, ground floor plan. Here it is. Yeah, this is the entrance gate. This is the gate in the north direction, and we given the setback of four feet from this point, and this is the compound wall with the five inch thickness, and we given the setback of four feet from the outer side of the compound wall. And after giving the four feet setback, we started the structure. At the starting point of the structure, we have the staircase. This is the staircase with the width of six feet. Each flight has the three feet and three feet wide. So this is the six feet and after that, this area is for parking purpose and some guarding purpose also. We provided this area in the ground floor and we given the setback of 3 feet from outer edge of the wall to the outer edge of the slab and this dotted area is slab area slab portion this all the dotted area which you are showing this the highlighted part is the slab area and this is the plinth area this walls this everything and this highlighted part is slab area boundaries of the slab these highlighted dotted lines are so from this outer edge of the slab point we have started the structure that means the walls with the dimensions of 9 inch this wall thickness is 9 inch and from outer edge of the wall to the outer edge of the slab we have the length of so width of 3 feet 6 inches we left the 3 feet 6 inches from outer of the edge of the wall to the outer edge of the slab in the south direction we given the setback of 2 feet 6 inches as well as in the west direction we given the same setback that is 2 feet 6 inches. This 2 feet 6 inches is up to the main wall. So here it is the main structure that is that. We provided the main door in the both the ways, in the both the direction, in the east direction and as well as in the north direction. From these main doors, we will get entered to the hall. These hall dimensions are 16 feet 1 inches in the horizontal, 
direction and 19 feet 2 inches in the vertical direction. In this hall, we provided one puja room with the dimensions of 6 by 6 feet. That means 6 feet in the horizontal and 6 feet in the vertical direction. And from this hall, we have the entrance to the bedrooms and dining and kitchen area. And in the east to south corner, we provided the kitchen and dining with the dimensions of the kitchen dimensions are 6 feet 8 inches in the horizontal direction and 7 feet 5 inches in the vertical direction. And here is the dining part with the dimensions of 9 feet in the horizontal and 10 feet 10 inches in the vertical direction. In this point, we have provided the one utility area for to store the groceries or something. This utility area is provided with the dimensions of 6 feet 8 inches in the horizontal and 3 feet 6 inches in the vertical direction. And this is the window we provided at this point in the south direction. After coming out of out from the dining area, we will enter to the hall. From the hall, we have opening to the bedroom with the door. In this way, we will enter to the bedroom with the dimensions of 13 feet in the horizontal and 12 feet in the vertical direction. In this bedroom, we provided the toilet with the dimensions of 8 feet in the horizontal and 5 feet in the vertical direction. And we have another bedroom with the dimensions of 13 feet in the horizontal and 12 feet 9 inches in the vertical direction. From this bedroom we have connecting toilet with the dimensions of 4 feet in the horizontal and 6 feet in the vertical direction. And we have a another toilet or WC water closet at the outside of this part for general purpose for outer purpose we provided one bath with the dimensions of 4 feet in the horizontal and 6 feet 4 inches in the vertical direction and this is the ground floor plan and we are going to the first floor plan so the ground floor is 2BHK, 2 bedrooms, hall, kitchen and we are coming to the first floor it is the 3BHK, 3 bedrooms, hall, kitchen and these are the staircases, from these staircases we will enter to the first floor in this direction. So we come to the first floor and as usual we provided the main doors in the east and north direction from these entrance main doors we will enter into the drawing room with the dimensions of 11 feet 8 inches in the horizontal and 12 feet 8 inches in the vertical direction from this drawing room we will go into the enter to the hall and for this hall we have a door at here in the east direction and the hall dimension is 16 feet 1 inches in the horizontal and 19 feet 2 inches in the vertical direction and as usually provided on puja room in the hall with the dimensions of 6 feet by 6 feet and we provided a dining kitchen and utility as usual as we provided in the ground floor as the same dimensions with the kitchen is with the 6 feet 8 inches in the horizontal and 7 feet 5 inches in the vertical and dining with the 9 feet in the horizontal and 10 feet 10 inches in the vertical direction and uh, utility with the 6 feet 8 inches in the horizontal direction and 3 feet 6 inches in the vertical direction and we have a bedroom master bedroom with the dimensions of 
13 feet in the horizontal and 12 feet 10 inches in the vertical direction. In this master bedroom, we provided the toilet with the 8 feet in the horizontal and 5 feet in the vertical direction. And this is the bedroom, another bedroom with the dimensions of 13 feet in the horizontal and 12 feet 9 inches in the vertical direction. And we have, as usually, we provided the one bathroom in this bedroom with the dimensions of 4 feet in the horizontal and 6 feet in the vertical direction and we have the third bedroom at this point with the dimensions of 13 feet in the horizontal and 12 feet 8 inches in the vertical direction from this bedroom also we have one bathroom with the dimensions of 4 feet in the horizontal and 6 feet 4 feet inches in the vertical direction and this is the window and this is the window 2 and this is the window 3 and this is the window 4 and this is the window 5 and this is the window 6 and this is the window 7 and this is the window 8 we totally provided 8 windows in the first floor And coming to the doors, the first one, second one, third one, fourth one, fifth one, sixth one, seventh one, eighth one, eight doors. That's it. Coming to the ground floor we provided the windows this is the first one at this point and second one is this point and third one at this point fourth one at this point and fifth one at this point and a sixth one at this point we provided the six windows in the ground floor and eight windows in the first floor and coming to the doors this is the first one second one third one fourth one fifth one and sixth one we provided these six doors in the ground floor and eight doors in the first floor that is this is the g plus one house plan for the site area of 40 by 60 thank you if you have any doubt please contact me through my mail id which